Hey everyone, welcome back to Figure Fantasy. So we have here Mini Can again, another updated uh, lineup for you guys for Apocalypse War. Let's check this out. Okay, this is a new lineup since uh, both girls have been out. So you have here both of the collab units, which is uh, Kuroko and the other one is going to be Mikoto. So they are in their rightful place. I'm just going to return them back. So again, this lineup uh, so far, the highest that I've had for this run, uh, maximum of 2 million uh, points that I've scored for this lineup. So you have here Megan, you have here both healers, uh, Mako and Zephyr in the special zones, which is increased figurines energy regen by one and ultimate power by 35 until it leaves the zone for more timely healing. So you have your Ayani on top and let's try this one out. So, so far, best core of this run. Um, most of the runs that I've had for this team Usually I end up with, uh, you know, um, having zero time with five of them usually alive. So let's hope that they give me the same um, result by this showcase. So again, um, Mikoto will be, will be able to take out the bottom row. Hopefully she doesn't die early. She is actually one key for you to burst a little bit more damage um, to the boss later on once she dispatches of the bottom row. So as for Korogo there, she will be able to stun the boss. That is her biggest role and uh, hopefully she survives uh, well into the waning minutes of or the waning seconds of this match. So, so far we're doing good. Both healers are supporting everyone. So bottom row is gone. Uh, all damage will be concentrated more on the boss. Again, hopefully uh, Mikoto will be able to survive up until the end. Okay, uh, timely heals needed from time to time. That is why they are there in the energy zones, both healers. So that they could rapid fire their healings uh zephyr as well give more energy and we are at 38 seconds guys so mako timely heals there uh, again i hope she survives because she is a crucial member of this team um timely heals please uh, zephyr need heal from zephyr to have a bigger you know bigger amount of heal from zephyr so we're at 1.4 million already so, so far so good we have been weathering it's 1.6 million we have 20 seconds left um the lowest that i had with this round is at 1.7 so we're past that we're nearing 2 million already it's 1.8 with uh, 12 seconds to go so far, everybody's holding up their end of the bargain. And after this round, we're at 2 million, guys. So after this round, we will be showcasing the equipment for everybody in this team. So hopefully we can reach 2.1. 2.1 it is. Can we? Can we? We're at 2.1 million. So that is it. So far, biggest... Um, you know, biggest total amount of points that I've had. So let's proceed to the equipment for all of these figures. Okay, equipment time. So for Zephyr, definitely you have all HP. Then you have a helper badge here. Then she has an exclusive enhancer helper badge for healing. Next is going to be Mikoto. Mikoto will have attack speed. So attack speed for the four piece set for the two piece set she'll be having critical set so she also has uh, th this is actually better than her exclusive badges her eternal nightmare badge which gives her boosted attacks and a lot of damage guys and uh, she has her um this it, this actually enhances her ultimate for her adornment um 
I'm not sure if this is a limited to her. I think this is. So I got this from the event. There you go. Next is going to be Kuroko. Kuroko here. Uh, we have her at uh, crit set for the two piece set. For the life, this is for life steal set. So she has life steal for enhanced survivability. Then she has eternal phantom badge. Also for her. Sorry, this is go this is eternal nightmare badge for Mikoto. So eternal phantom badge for for Kuroko, as you can see, and no adornment. Okay, next is going to be Ayane Okada, which has lifesteal and defensive set. And uh, she has Eternal Midsummer Badge to, to trigger more of her freeze. And she has her, her exclusive, um, uh, what do you call this? Exclusive adornment for Ayane. Next is going to be Mako. Mako has all HP. And also has a helper set. And the last one would be Megan. So Megan has ultimate set and heal set. This contributes more to her shield. And she has an eternal glory badge for her badge. Okay, guys. So that is it for the equipment for all the figures. So hopefully this helped you for other um alternates or if you don't have some of the figures please do chat me up in the comment section so that i could give you recommendations so thank you very much guys take care stay safe this is the warden and i'm out of here